Hey, Mark the Mechanics here. Um, I'm just showing you guys some cool stuff. Our big one ton Dodge 3500. I just put a new refurbished engine in this and uh, golly, we've got some problems. So coolant gone um, and we have oil in the diesel cup in the diesel cups um, I think under the injectors is where those are so uh, what we're gonna do is he bought some dye that you put in and run for just a minute and then you use a black light and the black light will show where you got your leak so uh, I'm gonna have him fired up and show you guys what that looks like he says it's pretty cool so wh what's the dye called UV no it's just a UV dye UV dye all right that's about one ounce per four gallons or five gallons and so you got to put two or three bottles in depending on what your fuel level is what we're going to do is i'm going to let you stand up here and we're going to verify that this is leaking and we've already ran it so you're going to see the um, the white that's in there or the green i guess it is you're going to see that but you're going to see it coming out of the injector o-ring so you're going to want to stand up here okay. See how it's kind of milky and white. You can't see it with the regular light. out of that injector so the injector is probably bad pretty wild and what that is a symptom of is getting the engine extremely extremely hot so apparently my uh my guys like to hot rod this truck yeah it's got a tuner on it tuner on it it's turned up apparently uh we like to we like to turn the the, the fuel pedal up too so like the throttle, like the throttle. <laughs> heavy footed you know, we got a lot of jobs to do. We got to get there quick, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so they got some stuff on order. Does that mean we got to get a... We're going to have to get one injector, it looks like. I'm going to see if that top's loose on that one, but I doubt it. Okay. Um, but funny enough, that actually should be warranted. Okay. We'll see about getting that one. But the uh, O-rings and everything should be here today or tomorrow. And we'll inspect everything once we get it torn down and see what's going on. Okay. But, uh, I also need to figure out why it got hot. So I'm guessing probably something to do with the cooling system. Yeah, I don't know if it was boiling over because it was being run too hard or it was low because of some other reason. But yeah, I'm not sure. We'll pressure test the cooling system, see what's going on, if we have any leaks or anything. All right. Well, we'll give you an update on her here soon.